School is out, the sun is high, and it should be a crime for any kid to plop down in front of the TV for the next three months, unless they're watching Two Casa Style. That's, fine. <laughs> that's right. Yeah. That's right. Just a little side note there. Exactly. But, so each week, we're going to be heading out to meet up with our DIYer, our do it yourselfer, Shonda, to give you a new activity to do with the kids. Take a look at what Brittany Flowers and Shonda did this week in their do it yourself project. Okay, I'm with Shanda, DIY expert and sister expert. She's my sister. Hi. Okay, what are we making today? Okay, so if you're anything like me, I read all my recipes off of my tablet. Yes. And the problem is when I'm in the kitchen, I'm trying to hold it up, it's falling down, I'm looking over, disaster. So I went looking to find if there is some kind of creative way to hold your tablet up. Mm -hmm. And there are. I actually have a store that I love, but a little bit expensive. Mm -hmm. They range anywhere from $30 to $50. And I thought, who wants to pay that? So You're I doing decided it yourself. we're going to do it ourselves, and I'm going to show you guys how. Okay. So where do we start? All right, for our supplies, all you need, I found an old cutting board. This actually was the paddle my mom used to get the old spankings going with spankin on paddle. Brittany. Spanking paddle. So we're getting rid of the spanking pat paddle. Mm -hmm. okay. um, I've actually stained the paddle. It was just plain wood, but you know, get your get your cutting board, paint it whatever ever color you want, or just leave it brown, whatever so it could be you like want. A darker color also. It could. The only other things you need, it, almost everybody has Scrabble. You just need. The Scrabble letter block. You're that done holds with Scrabble. Them. Scrabble's old. You can play it on your phone. I didn't even have Scrabble. I text all my neighbors. My neighbor had Scrabble. Let me have it. So if you don't have it, ask a neighbor. Somebody has Scrabble. Yes. And then you can use a building block. I actually didn't have a building block, but I, all I did was cut a piece of wood at a 60, de 60 degree angle. Okay. But you can just use a children's wooden building block and that will work perfect for your back. Okay. So I went ahead and stained already the cutting board and this. Okay. So I just need to finish staining this. All right. So for this project I chose to use more of a white stain. Now you don't have to use the stain. You can use the paint if you want. Just choose your color. Paint it whatever color you want. But I have found that for stain what you can do is put a latex glove or some kind of glove on and then put your husband's sock or your brother's sock or your own sock over it because it's long and it works better than a paintbrush. If your wood already has, like if you have a building block and it already has some kind, some kind of paint on it, you'll want to sand it first. But this is unfinished wood, so we could just go for it. Okay, so the next step, I like more of a vintagey look. So you're just going to take some kind of sander, and you just want to kind of sand it and rough it up a little bit. Okay, so now we're done sanding it. Sand it as much as you want. All you have to do now is get wood glue, your Scrabble piece. You're going to glue your Scrabble piece to the front, and then when we're done with that, we're going to glue the building block onto the back to hold it up. And you want to glue it so that the iPad has something to sit on. Okay, so now once the front is dry, you're just going to do the same thing and glue the block onto the back. That's it. Voila. You have a beautiful place to look at your iPad or your tablet. Play you can look Flappy at, Bird. Look at your recipes. Go to Pinterest. Go to casa.com, obviously, watch style, easy, and no more spankings from mom. That's right, no more. So if you want any more information on this, if you want to learn how to do it, just go to casa.com and click on the Casa blog. Bye.